What's going on guys, I am with the Moose and today I'm back with Bundle Bunch, the Bundle Bunch, whatever you want to call it. We are back for our first game. If you guys missed the uh, you know actual bundle opening, the packs and everything like that and the rules for the actual series, definitely make sure you click below. There will be a link to that video. It's going to give you an entire you know, you know, know, visualization of how the series is going to go and you definitely want to be uh, you know, aware of how everything's going to go. It's a fun series and it should be a great time, but we're going to hop into our first game. This is the team, of course, Khalil Mack, Geno Atkins, and Gio Bernard are our only elites, but it should be a good time. So we're going to hop into game number one and hopefully get a victory so we can get another pro pack. If you guys missed the actual, you know, bundle opening and everything to set this team, what I did for the playbooks is just pick whatever the first one came up. So honestly, I have no clue what offensive playbook this is. I completely forget, but it does have the pistol in it, and I do really like the pistol formation, so I'm probably going to be rocking that a lot. But definitely for the first couple games, it might be a little bit difficult for me to get, you know, crazy big-time plays, but hopefully we can move the ball with consistency. Going back to Geo on the ground right here. Looks like he's using Derek Wolf. I think that's who that is. Geo, nice run for A. There we go. Second and two here. Let's see if he blitzes that right outside linebacker. Not quite, but A is wide open. There we go. Delaney. Ah, Derek Carr just missed him a little bit behind him. If Derek Carr let him a little bit more on that throw, I probably had the, you know, catch and a nice gain. But here we go. First down. Gio Bernard. That's exactly what we needed. Might be going deep here. We'll see if we can find somebody open. That would be fantastic. Got Y open. He got through pretty easily. Oh, my goodness. Right. Whoever that is getting clobbered. That was Kendall Wright. I completely forgot about that. For some reason, I thought it was Jarius Wright. I don't know why I thought that but hey bernard pierce there we go our silver beast getting the first down running a quick play action here hopefully we can get it off we'll see he's been getting decent pressure looks like b is wide open there we go doug baldwin he's to the end zone great play design great play calling we're in for the td there we go absolutely perfect possession right there did everything right in my opinion really you know found some plays in the playbook that i want to go to and hopefully we can do the same on defense now Alright, it is a 3-4 playbook. I honestly hadn't even looked if it was 3-4 or 4-3. I do like 3-4 a little bit better, although the guy I'm using in this formation that I'm on is the middle linebacker number 2, and I'm not a huge fan of him, so we'll see if we can make plays. Oh my god, what a pass right there. Found the you know hole in the zone and got a completion. Nice play by the opponent. Looks like he's also got Marshawn Lynch, so hopefully we can contain beast mode. That would be fantastic. Right there, getting an insane catch, and he's already across midfield. This is definitely not what we wanted to see. Now I'm on Khalil Mack, trying to make some plays, hopping into some nickel coverage, and see if we can do something. Looks like he's going to the ground. Beast mode. There we go. Brought him down for only a couple yards. Second and seven. Come on. we got to step up, make some plays right here, right now. He's going to the sidelines. Oh, and he almost had it. Wow, that was going to be a crazy catch. That dude almost had that play. That was a very nice play call. Very nice design. And he's getting one here. we got to bring him down. There we go. He's about five or six yards short of the first down. Here we go. My opponent's going for it on fourth and six. Cannot say I'm surprised at all. Now he's going to the sideline. Here we go. And whoever Williams is is coming down with it. Nice play. Getting the pick in the red zone. Great play there. That was actually Kawan Williams. I still got to remember everybody on my team's name just because I usually don't use these guys. So it's definitely a learning curve for me. But right there, only getting a few on the ground. Here we go. Second and eight. Going to the toss play. Gio Bernard. You're definitely going to rely on him this drive if I can. That would be fantastic. Go get that block. There we go. He dove too early. Now Gio... I was about to say off to the races, but I could not juke out those guys. But hey, I'll take a 12-yard gain. Going five wide here. Obviously going to the pass. Looks like A is wide open. He blitzed almost everybody, so I'm going to take my easy yardage. Delaney Walker, another first down. Running the same play action play that I scored on the last time. We'll see if it can work again. That would be impeccable and unbelievable. Let's see. Oh, A is wide open. Oh, he's going over to cover, and we missed him. That was my fault. I hit him too late. Let's see what we can get here. Third and seven. Got to pick up this first down. Can we do it? B could be open in Derek Carr. Missing the throw. We're going to have to punt. Had to punt on that drive. That's definitely one of the issues with having a gold quarterback. It's just bound to happen. Now he's got somebody wide open. That was my zone. That is my mistake. And he's getting another first. My opponent killed us our last drive for the first couple plays of the drive. So hopefully we can shut him down a little bit. Now he's going across the middle. And he's able to. Oh my goodness. I thought he was able to catch that. That would have been absurd. Second and ten here. Come on. We got to shut him down. Make sure we take this lead into halftime. Oh, he's got beast mode out on the side, and he's getting about six. Good play. Third and five right here. Can we stop this first down possibility? No, we cannot. Now we got to bring him down. Dwight Lowry making the touchdown saving tackle. First and ten now. This dude is just killing me through the air. I cannot seem to stop him at all. He's going to it again. Can we shut it down? Khalil Mack swatted away. There we go. Would have loved to pick, but good swat. Let's get it. Under a minute to go in the first half. Can we do something to mess them up? Oh my god, he tried to hurdle me. That would have been crazy. Third and four. Let's get the stop. Let's shut him down and make sure we have the ball. Oh my god, no way! How did he find him open there right through the zone? Great pass. 
This is crazy right now. This dude is just roasting me on offense. I can't do anything right there. Quentin Demps, you got to scoop that. Definitely would have loved the pick right there, but hey, I guess I'll take the no touchdown as well right here. Come on, Mike Neal. Somebody go get beast mode. There we go. Nice tackle. Great play. He's got 10 yards to go. He's running the hurry up offense. Can we stop him? Right there we go. We can. Quentin Demps, he finally picks it off, and now he's off to the races. Quentin Demps, can he outrun Ricardo Lockett? I believe that's who that is. Maybe it's Tyler Lockett. No, yes, he can. Let's go, Quentin Demps into the end zone with three seconds left in the half. What a game-changing play. Quentin Demps for 100 yards, the pick six, baby. And probably the quit as well. That would be fantastic. That would be absurd. What a play by Quentin Demps, though. He has conceded the game, so we're going to open a pro pack. Very good first victory. I'm liking how the team is shaping up, but we're gonna, we got a pro pack to try to improve the team. All right, guys, here we are. We got a victory, so we get one pro pack. Let's do it. We're guaranteed at least a gold, but hopefully it's an elite because we definitely could use some. We also could use a strong safety or a right guard. That would be pretty nice. Or even an upgraded quarterback right here. We get a Greg Olson. I'll take it. I'll take the elite. Didn't really need a tight end. I already had Delaney Walker and Jordan Reed there, but hey, I'm not going to complain about that at all. That's a very good pull. Greg Olson, very happy about that. And honestly, like I said, I wanted an elite and we got one. So let's take a look at how that's going to affect the team. And I'll show you guys in just a sec. Alright guys, here is the updated roster with Greg Olson obviously starting at tight end. He had to be. Delaney Walker moving on to tight end number two. I really like his run block, so when he's in on you know two tight end sets and everything like that, he's going to be very effective for me. And then Jordan Reed, I moved him over to wide receiver number five. He's actually a 77 at wide receiver, so I was pretty happy with that. I moved him to or wide receiver number four, I should say. He's at wide receiver number four. Um, he's pretty good at wide receiver, so I put him there, and then I just bumped Travis Benjamin from four to five. So pretty simple changes, but that is the squad. We played pretty well in my first game, I'm not going to lie. That was a pretty good game, especially for only a 79 overall team. Definitely not, you know, the best team you've ever seen, but I'm pretty happy with it. You know, Gio Bernard played well. Derek Carr had a few good throws, a few bad ones, but that's what I expect. And obviously that crazy play by Quentin Demps at the end really sealed it up. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like down below. And as always, definitely leave me some feedback and comments down below on how I can improve this series. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you later.